best poets who exists, who's alive today, is a woman who lives here in Nashville named Colette Strasberg. I read this book from beginning to end, and I don't even like poetry very much, but I couldn't put it down. This is one of my favorites, called Old Home Spaces. Do the places we have been hold the scent of us after we are gone? Are we permanently planted there like bulbs in the soil? Or, upon our leaving, before the dust has even settled on the red dirt roads, are we settling by the back waters as forgotten as memories from the crib? I need the wild lupins along the fence line to ask where I have gone, to wonder if I am well. Their stems should shudder slightly with, when touched by a stranger's hand. I want to whisper to them, those flowers I bundled with loco weed and flax every Mother's Day. Tell them I still smell the sweetness of baby green under my nails. I need the willow outside my childhood window to have tucked memories of me into the craggy recesses of its bark. Then I can return one day, peel back that bark, and show my children who I've been. If I could, I'd rise on the arc of hometown breezes, reach out with the tiny hands of lilacs, and touch all the people I once knew. I would make them think of me and wonder why. With their skin suddenly raised in goose flesh, would they mistake this movement of intimacy for a love of the blooms? Would they simply chalk it up to deja vu? I could lay down in sweetness if they would only toy with the possibility that I'd never fully gone.